Well, we're getting ready to leave. Got the trailer all packed up. Sophie's in the truck, worried sick that I guess we're gonna leave her, she thinks. Gotta get ready and hook the, whoop, must be garbage. I'm gonna hook the trailer up. Start on our journey today. Dean and Nancy must be inside packing. They don't got the trailer hitched yet, but they're getting there. There's Mike. Unhooking all the hoses and stuff. He's going to be an expert at this by the time we make it to Arizona. And it's time to go. There she goes. On the road we go. Dean doing the finishing touches to his. I think they're about ready to. Nancy looks excited in the truck. Travelers, this is the Travelers Inn RV Resort in Yakima, Washington. It's a pretty nice RV park. That's the time of the year where they're, they got a hops plant here and so we kind of had this smell that. The first day I thought it was a, a skunk, but it was just the hops, my sister told me. So, uh, yeah, if you're in Yakima, it's not a bad place to stay. So we're on our way now. <clears throat> Should have had an eye on it. Oh, we're on camera and we didn't realize it. Hi! <laughs> the gate was closed and we're like, oh my God, what are we going to do? The gate's closed, but hey. It's, it's got a, it's got an infrared eye that when the vehicle comes yeah. up there, it automatically opens. So we're up early. We're on our way. We've got to go over Dead Man's Pass today. I had myself all worked up over that pass somehow. I was like pretty weird over it. But my sister's been over it. She told me it's okay. So we'll let you know how okay it really was. Well, we're going up Dead Man's Pass. Somehow we passed some semis, so I guess we're doing okay. Yeah, we've got almost 9,000 pounds in the trailer. Combined weight of 17,000. A little over 17,000 pounds. And we're going up 6% grade. Six miles, we're doing 50 miles an hour and 3,000 RPM. So, we're not doing too bad. I think once we're over this pass, I think that, I think it will be smooth sailing after this. This is the pass I've been dreading. And we're doing okay. Carrying our trainer behind us. <laughs> It's a long ways down there, there, right? Pretty. There's a viewpoint we could have pulled over. Oh. Yeah, but I don't want to start. Yeah, we're, up the yeah, we're, we're not going to start. You got to get the right ditch. lane. You get the right lane, you can get a better picture here. Yeah. It, it is beautiful up here. Look at that. Wow. It's nice. So I think it's like a six mile climb. I didn't check to see how many miles we've gone already. I'll let you know when we make it over. I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but look, it's snowing. Got a little snow coming down. I think I think we might be to the top or almost to the top. I'm not I'm not really sure, but it's snowing. And hey, we made it. Well, this is the chain up area here, so it could be. Oh. It's not go up six miles. And probably, uh, I don't know if we've gone six miles. Oh, we might have more ways to go. <laughs> but we still got to get down off this mountain, too, but you know, we'll make it. I just thought I'd go show you the snow. It's snowing. It's still snowing, and it looks like the snow is. Starting to stick. Starting to stick. Look at this. Still up 
still up on the mountain. We haven't came down the pass yet. But, uh, yeah. Like a little blast of winter before we go to the Arizona desert, right? <coughs> yeah. Little, little, little snow. Yeah. The road's clear. We're, we're good on this. So we're going to go from winter to summer. <laughs> yep. Wish you were here. <laughs> yep, all you people at home. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, we just <clears throat> came over Blue Summit, or Blue Mountain, 4,193 miles. Feet. Feet. <laughs> miles. 4,193 feet. Yeah. And uh, it is snow. It's pretty, though. Hope we're at the top. I keep thinking we're at the top and we're never at the top. Wait, this might be it this time. Maybe. Going downhill now. Out of the snow. Look at that view. Here's where we stop for the night. Country Corners Campground RV Park. A nice little park, quiet. Got plenty of room. Down here is the town, gas station, store. And that's it. Ain't very big. But we are in Caldwell, Idaho. It was a hay truck. Made it, finally. We were like uh, on fumes, on gas. I was praying. <laughs> and we, there was a gas station not too far from here that was able to fill up. So, yeah, I was a little worried. All those mountains kind of sucked the gas out of us. But we're kind of lucky we got side-by-side -side spots, so this is good. So Mike's leveling the trailer, and then we'll let the slides out and set up inside, but we're just going to kind of chill tonight. But, yeah, we made it this far. Only one little accident with Dean. Close to the office, showers, laundry. I haven't walked, walked around the park yet, but I think it's going to be a pretty nice park. We're here for two days, and then we'll be on the road again. Dean's setting up his sewer, too. Got a nice big tent area. I think there's a little creek down there. The fire pits. Looks like they have a a dog area where you can take your dog in and let it run loose. I got a little pond here. Looks like there's a couple of them backed up to it. Ain't good for nothing but uh, looking at. So we put a couple duck decoys out there. <laughs> well, <clears throat> left Yakima yesterday and Cruise through Idaho, up Dead Man's Pass, up to Blue, up through Blue Mountain, 4,100 feet, almost 4,200 feet. Truck cruised along pretty good, pulling the trailer. Uh, 
pretty country boy all the way to where we're camped at now probably you know a little over 200 miles just all through the mountains very pretty in the mountains the highway in eastern Oregon uh, by Pendleton going over the mountains and into Idaho are some of the some of the best roads that I've driven on nice and smooth hit some snow on the top of the mountains sticking on long side of the road but not on the road so <clears throat> if you like our channel uh, subscribe share it with your friends and have them subscribe and we'll have more coming we'll be moving uh, tomorrow headed to uh, Bring, Bring, Bring Graham, Utah so we'll get some more pictures and start another segment tomorrow